Hi, in this video, we're going to be looking at how to play an animation once in Unity. So the current problem I'm having is I want to play this animation, right? This is a blood splatter animation and it should play when I'm shooting at the zombie. All right. When the bullet hits the zombie, this blood splatter animation must play only once. But if I play the game, watch what happens. So you see here, if I pick up the gun, you see the animation is already playing and it's on a loop. So this is a problem. I only want this to happen when, I'm, when I've hit the zombie, right? So let's see how we can fix this. So the first thing you must check is the name of your animation, right? So if I just go to my animator right here, you can see that the name of my animation is blood. This is important, okay? So once you, you have noted the name of your animation, you can then go to your script, wherever you want to play the animation once. So on my script, this is my enemy script, right? So when the enemy takes damage, right, this is where I want to play my animation. So first I'm gonna go to the top, right, of my enemy script, and I'm gonna create a public variable. So I'm gonna say public animator, animator, right? And I'm gonna call it animator. Okay, so I just created this variable right here and then I'm going to go down to my take damage function, okay? And I'm going to call that variable that I just created. I'm just going to say animator dot play, right? So now inside the play function, I need to put a string, which will be the name of the animation. So you will remember that the name of my animation is blood, right? So this is where you put the name of your animation, right? So it's going to be blood. And then you want to put values from 0 to 0, 25. Okay, so that's it, right? This is it on the script. Only two lines that you have to add, right? So now that we're back in Unity, what you have, I'm going to go to my zombie object, right? And then I'm going to go to the enemy script. So you see this enemy script right here. And this is the field that we created, remember? This is the object that we created on the script. So we just need to pass in our animation inside this object, right? So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna grab the blood animation and I'm gonna put it in the animator object field. Okay, so, and that's that. That's all you need to do, right? Now let's play and see. So I'm just gonna clear my console and I'm gonna press play. So, all right, you see that it's still playing, right? So the reason why it's still playing is because the animation is on the loop, right? The animation is on the loop. So we need to do one last step. Let's exit out of the game and then let's go to our blood animation. Let's go to animator right here, right? And then cl double click the animator, right? And then uncheck this loop time right here, right? So we're going to uncheck the loop time. This should stop the animation from looping. Okay, and then now let's press play again. All right, so now if we see, you see that there's no animation playing on the zombie now. And watch if I shoot at the zombie. You see, it only plays once. Every time the bullet hits the zombie. Okay, so I hope this was helpful for you. It was helpful for me. So, thanks for watching and please like and subscribe or let me know in the comments what you think.